Hi, Michelle Seitz here. You're watching Version Control. Here's the scenario. You have a file that you want to save as different versions without saving it with different file names. You can do this in Word 2003 with the versions command. Watch this video to learn how to do this. You have a document open and now you would like to save it as different versions of the same file. To do this, have all your changes made to the document. Now go to File, Versions, and now the Versions dialog box is displayed. Click the Save Now button. A new dialog box is displayed. At the top of the dialog box, your file is now date and time stamped and will automatically enter the name of the author. There's also a comments box. In this box, you may want to document the changes that were made since the last version. After you've entered your comments, click OK. Now, if we go back into the versions dialog box, you'll see in the existing versions field, the version that you just saved with its date and timestamp and the comments. You can either continue to make changes and create new versions, or you can pass it along to a colleague to make their changes. The document may end up with several versions made by different contributors. So let's go back into file versions. So now the version control may look like this with three different authors. To delete a version, select it and click the delete button. If you want to open a previous version, just click on it and select open. The file is automatically named as the version with the date and timestamp in the file name. If you want your document automatically saved when you close the document, Let's go back into File, Versions. You can click this box and it will automatically save a version when you close your document. And that is the end of this lesson, Version Control.